Who's that? A girl in my class. Zero friends. Super weird. Yeah. I thought we were friends. Why did you accept my friendship? student, Marina Mills, committed suicide. The was a video uploaded. I urge you not to watch it. I saw the medical report. It is insane. So according to you, Ms. Woodson, this video just magically appeared on your timeline. I'm not posting this. Did you try changing your password? Yes, yes, I've tried everything. She's even back in my friends list. You have no idea how crazy that is, do you? That is what code normally looks like. Not this. This isn't code. It's her. <laughs> it's possessing them and haunting them. This is not real! We've all been dying for her! Every time I turn off the lights, there's this woman waiting in the shadows. I see her too. Each one of us is being haunted. This thing. Mom? Hey, Martin, what's up? Did we wake you? What? A long time ago, I had a friend named Diana. And something really bad happened to her. Everyone is afraid of the dark. And that's what she feeds on. Show yourself. Becca? Are we gonna die? No. We need to find more light. We've had a number of potential nannies come through already. Do you think you can manage? Of course. I'm Malcolm. Hi. I'm the grocery boy. Well, grocery man. <laughs> Lead the way. Allow me to introduce Mr. Hilcher. And this is our son, Brahms. <laughs> Music gives him so much joy. Brahms is not like other children. It is very important that you follow these rules. Be good to him and he'll be good to you. No offense, Brahms, but you kind of creep me out.
You okay? I needed someone else to see it. See what? If you leave him alone, they don't give you a sign. This is like some kind of magic trick, right? It's not a trick. Tell me about the real Brahms. He was downright strange. A little girl from town used to come out here to play with Brahms. They found her body in the woods. By the time the police arrived, the place was up in flames. Brahms didn't make it out. Hello? No one's been out there for years. You wouldn't hurt me, would you, Brahms? It's not safe in this house. You don't understand what's happening. He's alive. Good to him, won't you? Mary, we invite you into our circle. If that's you, blow out the candles. Oh my god. This is a scam. She deserved it, Mom. It's your job to stand at the curtains and not attack the clients. And you, young lady? What's a scam? Woke up this morning feeling fine. You are so weird. Does she have a lot of problems? It's nothing too concerning. What's this? New prop for work. Spirit, can you hear me? Yes, we can. And we can see you. Who are you talking to, Doris? Daddy, are you there? Who are you? Did you see her writing this? No. Because it's Polish. Doris, who did this? I'll show you. Are you here? Something is happening that we can't understand. I'm concerned about your girl. The spirit world is dangerous. What are you doing? I'm not doing it. Stop it! Do you know what it feels like to be strangled to death? <laughs> something is wrong with Doris! She's experiencing something amazing! I believe she is channeling powers we do not understand. Doris? Yes. This is my home. Get out now. No, this is not your house. Now, what's your name? My name is Bill Wilkins, and I'm 72 years old. What do you make of that voice? Sounds confused. Do you see now? The voice on this tape is coming from an 11-year-old girl. They're calling it England's Amityville. There is a family that desperately needs our help. After everything we've seen, there isn't much that rattles either of us anymore. But this one, this one still haunts me. Does it feel like the voice is coming from inside you? More like it's coming from behind me. Like I'm being used. Janet, are you all right? Stop calling me Janet. She's such a good girl. What's that wrong with her? In a 
repressing spirit will try to force you to commit the ultimate sin. And what's that? Murder, suicide, or both? You believe us, don't you? Sensing a presence? I'm not sensing anything. All I can sense is their own fear. <laughs> You're bleeding. What is happening? I had a premonition of your death. Who's that? The family's just a pawn. Something inhuman wants to kill you. If we keep doing this... You're going to die.